Liberty County is the latest to try and fight drug addiction in its county jail. The sheriff's office has received a grant to hire a counselor to deal with mental health problems or substance abuse. As News 13's Thomas Schultz tells us, sheriff's officials are hoping it will stop inmates from reoffending once they're released. Liberty County Sheriff's Office partnered with Northwest Florida Health Network a couple weeks ago to create a new mental health coordinator position. Authorities say the role will help people with substance abuse or mental health issues find help before things take a turn for the worst. A lot of that crime is created through mental health problems and substance abuse problems. Northwest Florida Health Network has similar programs in eight other Panhandle counties. Officials say a grant worth just over $58,000 in Liberty County could change people's lives. For a long period of time, we didn't have anywhere to send people for services uh, when it comes to drugs. In a small town, small county, you see it on a daily basis. Physician Outreach Coordinator Tiffany Cessna says many people struggle with mental health issues in the rural county. It could mean the world for somebody if they feel like they don't have anything here. It's kind of isolated in Liberty County. You're surrounded by national forests and you're 50 miles from the nearest town. Liberty County Sheriff's Office new mental health coordinator says there was one instance that pushed her into her new career path. A couple years ago, I was working in dispatch and we had a little girl whose mom was suffering some substance abuse and her mother had to be taken away to a facility and I was in charge of watching the little girl until some family could get here. Now she hopes to help as many people as possible and possibly save lives. In Bristol, Thomas Schultz, News 13, Panhandle Strong. If you or someone you know needs help, you can find out how on our website, mypanhandle.com.